Welcome to USMLEFastTrack.com. The section we're going to talk about today is from First Aid for the USMLE Step 1, 2013 Edition. Page 454. Name the groups of drugs that can be used as intravenous anesthetics. The groups of drugs that can be used as intravenous anesthetics includes barbiturates, benzodiazepines, aryl cyclohexamines, opioids, and propofol. What is the mnemonic to help you remember the groups of drugs that can be used as intravenous anesthetic? The mnemonic to remember this is just remember BB King on opioid proposes foolishly. The first B standing for barbiturates, the second B standing for benzodiazepine, K in King standing for ketamine, which is the aryl cyclohexamine, and opioids proposes foolishly is for opioids and propofol. Name the barbiturate that can be used as intravenous anesthetic. The barbiturate that's used for this is theopentyl. Describe the anesthetic features of theopentyl. Theopentyl is a high potent drug, it's highly lipid soluble, and it has rapid entry into the brain. Theopentyl is used for induction of anesthesia and short surgical procedures. The effects of theopentyl is terminated by rapid redistribution into the tissues such as in the skeletal muscle and fats. Theopentyl does also decreases the cerebral blood flow. For more information on this topic, click on the link in the description section below. For a full USMLE Step 1 review, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com where we help you review the entire first aid for the USMLE Step 1 with high quality videos and hundreds of detailed pictures for a better understanding of the material. So to learn from the best USMLE review book, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com.